Hello guys, welcome to my channel, hope everything is well. So let's go ahead and try this glowy makeup look. And this is a really soft makeup look. So to start off, I just apply a moisturizing balm in my lips. And today I'm gonna create the color for my foundation. So I'm gonna use the cream color from Kryolan and this is in the primary colors. Okay, so the first step is to moisturize my skin. So I'm gonna use a very good serum. Today I'm using the Yellow Ronic Serum from Wishful and this is from Huda Beauty. So I'm gonna apply a few drops in my face and then I'm gonna just spread it out using a dual fiber brush like this. What is left in the brush I apply in my nose, in my neck and in my chest. Just to hmm, use all the product. Also, before I do anything in my face, I just wash my face, I just clean my whole face to remove any dirt or rest of makeup and I just fill in the brows a little bit and I apply a brow gel to set in the place all day and also to brush up a little to create this kind of natural effect. Next, I'm gonna apply a glowy moisturizer to kind of give me this natural glow from inside to the outside in my skin. So I apply from Denisa Myricks. And I focus the products in the areas that I want to accentuate a little more. Now I'm gonna apply the cream color to create my foundation. And I really love to use the mix of foundations like this because I can create the exact color for my face. I absolutely love to work with the colors like this. I'm gonna create the exact shade for my foundation and I'm gonna apply all over just to balance the color, especially in pictures or anything else that I'm gonna use. I'm gonna apply what is left in the brush in my neck and also in my chest. Next, I'm gonna use a product that I bought recently in Sephora and I really like this product. So this is the cream contour from Wear Beauty and this is the shade Happy Soul. For me, it works amazing and I love the color. I love how it blends, how easy it is to apply and also to blend my skin. Stunning. Now for concealer, I'm gonna apply and I'm gonna let it set for a few minutes before I blend. So here I'm using the white shade and this is the color fix from Denisa Myricks. And also I'm gonna use the Fall Filter Concealer from Huda Beauty. And this is the exact shade for my face, but I decided to add the white in the inner corners because I really wanna highlight a little. So in the mix of colors, it looks amazing. I'm gonna blend these colors with a firm fluffy brush like this which is easy to spread out the product and what is left in the brush I like to apply in the eyelids as well remember the Huda Beauty concealer dries matte and it dries so fast so I don't have to wait too much when I apply the concealer in the eyes I like to let it set for a few minutes, but not too much. Just blend the concealer and yeah. Now I'm gonna change the brush and I'm gonna blend the cream contour. I was curious about the product and I really like how it performs in my skin. It looks amazing, so natural, soft, and at the same time, I look sculpted. So I really like, I'm gonna take my time to blend not too much time because it blends easily and now I'm gonna use another primary shades to create my blush shade so I'm gonna mix a few drops from Zanessa Myricks color fix I don't want to use too much because this product is very 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 pigmented so to look natural like this I use just a little tiny bit and now I'm gonna apply oh my god my favorite highlighter at the moment and this is from Anastasia Beverly Hills wow this highlighter is not a white color it just glows gold 
and glows kind of a champagne gold stunning i absolutely love it and i can use this highlighter in any skin tone so i bought recently in sephora and i was thinking oh wow why i didn't bought before this highlighter because i really like it and i can use this highlighter in the eyes as i'm gonna do here later so now i'm gonna use brunette palette from melt cosmetics and i'm gonna take another brush and i'm gonna apply in the outer corners and in my crease also i'm gonna blend this eyeshadow which is a cool brown i'm gonna blend to the inner corners and outer corners creating the cat eye shape for my eyes with the eyeshadow and next i'm gonna use the same highlighter in the eyelids and inner corners now i'm gonna use a loose powder from huda beauty and this is easy bake so i'm gonna apply in the under eye area with a powder puff because i really want to set this area and also i'm gonna set using just a little bit in a few areas of my face but i don't want to apply all over for example because later on i'm gonna change the product and i'm gonna use a compact powder to apply in the rest of the face and this is for the glowy effect without looking exaggerated so i really need to balance the amount of product so i'm gonna apply the loose powder in a few areas and i'm gonna let it set for about five minutes i'm gonna apply it with a powder puff like this and now i'm gonna remove the excess product from my face and later i'm gonna just change the brush and change the product to really finish my skin so the next products that i'm talking about is glazed skin finish from melt cosmetics and i'm using here the color called fair which is the lightest color and pinkish color as well so i decided to use this one and i really really like the glow that it gives me so i'm gonna apply in the rest of the face changing the brush of course to really take another product and this is the products that i'm telling you guys i love the glow that it gives me because it's not a strong glow but a natural glow and if you like you can use this product in the morning as a highlighter that's what i do sometimes to go to work so this is how i conclude my skin if you like you can apply a setting spray to finish but today i'm gonna leave it like this because here i'm using the exact amount of product so i don't really have to apply a setting spray and most of the times i don't really do it but now let's move on to the lips so here i'm gonna do the diamond lips that's why i just contour my lips in the natural shape and apply a nude lipstick so the lip contour deck of scarlet and the matte lipstick from huda beauty and next to create the diamond look i'm gonna apply in the center of the lips the color fix in the metallic shades ballerina and gold mine and i'm gonna apply it just in the center and to set the product i'm gonna go back to the highlighter that i'm using all over my face so i'm using this amazing highlighter from anastasia beverly hills again just in the center of the lips and to finish the lips i'm gonna apply a lip gloss and this is a transparent lip gloss so i don't have any shimmer i just want to create this kind of mirror effect so i'm gonna apply the gloss on top and to conclude the makeup look i apply a little fake lash and this is so small i almost cannot see the fake lashes and a lot of mascara in the eyes oh of course i apply the fake lashes in the eyes so i hope that you like this makeup tutorial much as i do this is my favorite kind of makeup looks thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and i see you later in the next videos Mwah. bye